Scientists know how old the universe is by playing it backward until the very first moment when everything exploded into existence. Let me explain. From ancient light traveling billions of years to reach us, to galaxies racing away at unfathomable speeds, every clue leads us to an epic story of time, space, and the very origins of the universe. It's like being detectives, but instead of fingerprints, we're looking at light, stars, and galaxies. First up is the Cosmic Microwave Background, or CMB. Think of it as the universe's baby picture, taken when it was just 380,000 years old. This ancient light is a snapshot of the universe's early moments and gives us major clues about its age. Next, we zoom out to the galaxies. Ever heard of the redshift? As galaxies move away from us, their light stretches, turning more red. This redshift tells us how fast the universe is expanding. And here's the cool part. By working backward, we can estimate how long this expansion has been happening. Also, did you know that we can tell a star's age by its temperature and also brightness? By studying the oldest stars, we get another piece of the puzzle. The oldest stars that we've found are nearly as old as the universe itself, which backs up to those 13.8 billion years. With all these cosmic clues about the universe's age, you might be wondering, how do astronomers actually gather this information? Well, it's all thanks to some super cool high-tech tools and a bit of clever science. So first, let's talk about telescopes, not the kind that you might have at home, but gigantic ones like the Hubble and also James Webb telescope. These are like our eyes in the sky, peering deep into the universe. They capture light from billions of years ago, helping us see the universe's past in incredible detail. Another awesome method is radiometric dating. It's like a cosmic clock. By studying meteorites and other space rocks, scientists can figure out when they formed. This gives us a sneak peek into the early days of our solar system, which is a big piece of the universal puzzle. And then there's the power of computers. Astronomers use computer simulations to recreate the universe's history. By comparing these simulations with actual observations, they can test different theories about how the universe evolved and how old it is. So let's address another confusing issue. If scientists say that the universe is 13.8 billion years old, then why do they see objects over 45 billion light years away? Well, the key lies in cosmic expansion. The universe is expanding. The universe has been stretching out since the Big Bang, and it's doing so faster than the speed of light. This stretching means that objects are now much further away than when they were when their light first set off towards us. And that's why we can see light from objects that are now 46.5 billion light years away, even though the universe is only 13.8 billion years old. And here's a mind blower. The observable universe is just a fraction of the whole universe. Beyond what we can see, the universe keeps going, potentially infinitely. But since light from those parts hasn't reached us yet, we can't observe or measure them. So when we talk about the universe's age, and also size, we're dealing with two different concepts. The age is about time, since the Big Bang, while the size relates to the vast distances light has traveled in an expanding universe. As amazing as our journey to uncover the universe's age has been, it's not without its challenges and limitations. Let's face it, figuring out the age of something 13.8 billion years old isn't exactly a walk in the park. One big challenge is dealing with uncertainties. In science, especially when studying something as vast as the universe, there's always a bit of guesswork involved. Even with the best tools, our measurements have error margins, which means we're constantly refining and updating our estimates. Another hurdle is the ever-evolving nature of scientific theories. As we develop new technologies and gather more data, our understanding of the universe evolves too. What we think we know today might change tomorrow as we learn more and more. And then there's the mystery of the unobservable universe. So we can only study what our instruments can detect. So there's always a possibility that there are parts of the universe that we haven't seen yet, which could totally Totally change our understanding of its age. So while we have some pretty solid ideas about the age of the universe, the journey to absolute certainty is filled with twists, turns, and a lot of cosmic detective work. It's what makes studying the universe so exciting and sometimes a little bit baffling. Finally, why is all of this so important? Why do we spend so much time and effort figuring out how old the universe is? Well, first off, knowing the universe's age helps us understand the story of everything, from the tiniest particles to the largest galaxies. It's like putting together a giant cosmic puzzle, where each piece represents a chapter in the grand story of the universe. Plus, this knowledge is crucial for other areas of science. Astrophysics, cosmology, even geology and biology are all intertwined. By understanding 
understanding the universe's timeline, we can better grasp how stars and planets form and how life itself might evolve in this vast expanse. And on a more philosophical note, knowing the age of the universe puts our own existence into perspective. It's both humbling and awe-inspiring to think about our place in this 13.8 billion year old story. It makes us wonder about our past, our future, and our role in this incredible universe. Understanding how old the universe is connects us to something bigger than ourselves. If you've enjoyed this cosmic adventure, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more space explorations, and share your thoughts in the comments below. What part of the universe's story fascinates you the most? Remember, every time you look up at the night sky, you're peering into the past, into the history of our universe. It's a vast, beautiful mystery that we're all a part of. Until next time, keep your eyes on the stars. Also, don't forget to watch the video on the right.